Hello everyone. Welcome to Math for You. How to solve thirteen six to the power of x minus twelve to the power of x equals four to the power of x to find the value of x. Thirteen six to the power of x minus twelve to the power of x equals four to the power of x. We Divide it by four to the power of x in both sides. Divide it by four to the power of x. So here is one, and here is one. Then we apply the formula that a to the power of n over b to the power of n equals a. Over b bracket to the power of n. So here is thirteen six divided by four bracket to the power of x minus twelve divided by four bracket to the power of x equals one. Thirteen six is same as six square. Divided by four is the mass two square bracket to the power of x minus twelve divided by four is three to the power of x equals one. Now we apply this formula, so it will be six divided by two bracket to the power of Two bracket to the power of x minus three to the power of x equals one. Then we apply the formula that a to the power of m bracket to the power of n equals a to the power of m n equals a to the power of n bracket to the power of m. So here. Is six divided by two is three to the power of x bracket squared minus three to the power of x equals one. Now three to the power of x is common, so we let three to the power of x equals t. So our equation will be t squared minus t equals one. Then we take this to the left side. So t squared minus t minus one equals zero. And we know t equals negative b plus or minus. Square root of b squared minus four times a times c divided by two a. Now in here, a is one, b is negative one, and c is negative one. So t equals negative b. B is negative one, so is one. Plus or minus square root of b squared is negative one bracket to the power of two minus four times a a is one times c c is negative one divided by two times a a is one so t equals one plus or minus Square root of negative one squared equals one minus four times one times negative one equals negative four, so minus negative four is plus four divided by two. Now we have two cases that t equals one plus square root of five. Divided by two, and another case is t equals 
1 minus square root of 5 divided by 2. At the beginning, we let 3 to the power of x equals t. So, it means 3 to the power of x equals 1 minus square root of 5 divided by 2. Then, the left side is greater than 0, but the right side is less than 0. So, this answer is rejected. Now, we look at this. 3 to the power of x equals 1 plus square root of 5 divided by 2. Now, we apply the log rule that log 3 to the power of x base is 3 equals log 1 plus square root of 5 divided by 2 base is 3. Then, we apply the formula that log a base b equals a times log b. So here we can take this and front. So x times log 3 base 3 equals log 1 plus square root of 5 over 2 base 3. Then this we know log a base a equals 1. So here x equals log 1 plus square root of 5 divided by 2 base 3. Now we have another formula that log a base b equals log a base m divided by log b base m. So this will be x equals log 1 plus square root of 5 divided by 2 divided by log 3. And this part, log a divided by b equals log a minus log b. So x equals log 1 plus square root of 5 bracket minus log 2 divided by log 3. This is the final answer. Thank you for watching and see you in the next video. Bye!